In today's episode, we are going to make an IoT based security camera using ESP32 game module and Telegram application. But this is not just another security camera, it's a camera with a twist. With a simple command like flash, you can illuminate the night, ensuring you have a clear view of your surroundings whenever you need it. And that's not all. A tape on your smartphone using the command photo unleashes the power of this incredible ESP32 camera module, capturing high quality images and instantly sending them to your telegram app right at your fingertips this is a brilliant combination of hardware and software unlocking a new level of control and security it's all about making your life safer and more convenient 24 by 7 and since this project is based on the iot internet of things so you can request images from any part of the world provided if the internet connection is available this security camera is designed with portability in mind you have the flexibility to power it using a single lithium ion battery a lipo battery or a 4s lithium ion battery pack just like the one i'm using here with a 5 volt and 3 amps power supply this setup has been invaluable for me not only for this project but also for powering my arduino based projects that demand higher current for the sake of simplicity i have opted not to include sensors like pir motion sensors microwave sensors or ultrasonic sensors in this version this way beginners can dive right in and get started without any complexity but stay tuned for my upcoming video where i will take this project to the next level by integrating one of these sensors making it fully automatic if you are eager not to miss any of my future videos and project updates don't forget to hit that subscribe button so without any further delay let's get started All you need is the ESP32 cam module and this ESP32 camera development board for uploading the program. But if you don't have this development board, then you can use the Arduino Uno for uploading the program. For this, you can watch my getting started video on the ESP32 camera module. But I highly recommend get yourself this ESP32 camera development board and trust me, it will save a lot of your time. Now, let's go ahead and set up the Arduino IDE. First of all, we will need to add the ESP32 cam module in the Arduino IDE. IDE because by default no ESP32 board is installed in the Arduino IDE and you can confirm this by going to the tools menu then to board and you can see there is no ESP32 board so first we will need to add it in the boards list but this go to my website and copy this board manager URL link then go back to the Arduino IDE go to the file menu then preferences and paste this link in the additional boards manager URLs next go to the tools menu then board and click on the boards manager search for the esp32 you can see we have arduino esp32 boards and esp32 by expressive systems so make sure you install this one and don't forget to select the latest version finally the board installation has been completed and now we can confirm this by going to the boards list you can see all the different variants of the esp32 boards have been added now let's go ahead and open the program before you start the programming first of all make sure you install the required libraries in the arduino ide for this is simply copy the library name then go to the sketch menu then to include library and click on the manage libraries paste the library name and install it follow the same exact steps for the other library it's already installed but needs an update so let's update it it's good to keep all your libraries updated you can download this program from our website electronicclinic.com make sure you change the ssid and password you will also need to change the bot token and chat id you will get it from the telegram app which i will explain in a minute so when your code is ready then all you need is to connect your esp32 camera module to your laptop or pc select the esp32 raw module upload speed 921600 flash frequency 80 megahertz flash mode qio partition scheme huge app 3 mb no ota and finally select the port and upload the program i have already uploaded this program and now let's set up the telegram application open the telegram application on your cell phone click the search button and then click on the bot father. Click on the restart. Click on the new bot to create a new bot. Choose a name for your bot. Then choose a username for your bot. It must end in bot. This is the bot token. Simply copy it and paste it in the programming next to the bot token. Click the bake button. This time search for the ID bot.
you will get the chat ID. Simply copy it and paste it next to the chat ID in the programming and that's it. Click the big button and click on the bot father. Finally, click on your bot link and start controlling and monitoring your ESP32 camera module. Support me on Patreon for more videos. I hope you liked today's episode. Like and share this video with your friends. See you in next episode and thanks for watching.